Cause I am seriously not in the mood for this dumb. You can walk, come on. Let's stand up. Evil cops get away with a lot of evil things, but sometimes their luck runs out. In this video, we will look at three cases where evil cops realized they had been caught. On January 20th, 2023, Earl Elmore Jr., who had reportedly been experiencing hallucinations due to alcohol withdrawal, was entrusted to the care of Finley and Cadigan. What the EMS workers did next will leave you shocked. It's the police. There's no one here with okay. He's hallucinating, he's having alcohol with... I don't want this problem with you. I just moved into this house. Like, like I don't need this. Okay. My dude. landlord lives across the street. He's having drunk hallucinations. He he called you guys for no reason. Do you want us to talk to him? He's 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 seeing stuff that's not there. Do you do you think he needs an ambulance? The, every time I take him to the hospital, all they do is release him. That's all. That, that's all they do. They're here now, ma'am. It's fine. What's, I mean, is he just drunk or is he He's high? He's having alcohol or? withdrawal hallucinations. Okay. He was a severe alcoholic. He hasn't had alcohol in four days. He's going through hallucinations from withdrawal. He's not being violent or anything? No, he's just okay. seeing stuff that's not there and then hearing voices in his head. Okay. So like, I mean, if, if you guys want to take him in for an evaluation, you're more than welcome to. If you want us to come in and talk to him, we'd, we'd be more than happy. Where's he at? He's in his bedroom in the way back. What's his name? Uh, Earl. Earl? It's the police. You called us, my man? You need some help? Wait, wait. Huh? You need an ambulance? North, North 28. Second Street. 48. Sweat. 248 North 8th Street. 24. Get the, the man needed serious medical help, and that was pretty clear. But for some reason, the cops still needed to ensure that he did. You know where you're at right now, man? Home. Where's home? <laughs> You know where home is? North 25th. Stay here with me. Well, we're Very gonna well. stay here, but you're not on North 25th. You know who the president is? You know what year it is, bud? Yeah. Let's start with this. You know what uh, your name is? Can you give us that? Earl 20. Earl Hall. Earl, what's your last name? What's going on with you, my man? Well, we're going to have an ambulance come check you out, my man. Make sure you're okay. Looks like you're having some kind of problems. Very peaceful music. Hey Earl, who's that female out there? <sighs> Who is she to you? Anna? Well, she's worried about you, my man. She said she's been struggling a little bit. She's been trying to get off the sauce a little bit. And that shit ain't easy, cold turkey, man. The officer's lack of concern for Earl right from the start was a big concern in itself, but things only got worse from there. What's up, bud? Can I get you some water? Yeah, yeah, man, we can get you some water. Yeah. <sighs> <sighs> Feeling a little better? Yeah. Yeah, you're sweating up a storm, my man.
bison? Uh, uh, water, water buffalo, yeah, I guess you're right with that. You see them on your, on your Montana. They kill a lot of people. How's that right? No, those are all Oh, 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 oh. Earl was literally struggling for his life, and these officers were standing there cold-blooded like it was nothing. They could have at least consoled him a little. This is Earl. I haven't been able to get much out of him. He was up on his bed and he just rolled off onto the floor after he's been slowly stripping off of those clothes. What's your birthday, man? After a tense wait, the EMS worker finally arrived, and let's just say that she was no better than the cops in that situation. It's your birthday. This is about all we've been able to get. Earl, sit up. Sit up. Come on, Earl. Let's let's Sit move, up. my man. What happened? Oh. Stupid. Stop. Stop. Sit up. Sit up now. I am not playing with you tonight. Sit up. What is your birthday? March twenty second. March twenty second. Go to the hospital, ma'am. We need. Then we need to get up. You're All gonna right. have to walk. We ain't carrying you. So let's let's get up on your feet. Cause I am seriously not in the mood for this dumb. You can walk. Come on, let's stand up. I'm gonna let you. I know you can do it. I've seen you do it. I swear, no. Stand up. Use your legs. Oh, oh, oh. Tomorrow, we'll get you some help, bud. Just take the coat, my son. Yeah. I gotta put it on. I got your coat. Come on. Sweating bullets. Nope. We're nope. Not doing that. We're gonna, only way we're gonna get you is if we walk through the house. Come on, You're not dead weight. Maybe we are. Alright. The way they were treating Earl was worse than what some people would treat an animal. It's just heartbreaking to see. What hospital you wanna go to? St. John's. Come on. Let's go. Help me up. Let's go. Come on. Help yourself. Alright. One, two. There you go. There you go. There you go. Come on, buddy. Keep it moving. Alright, we're moving. We're moving. Let's keep going. One foot in front of the other. Come on, buddy. We got you. We'll hold you up, but you gotta walk forward. Come on, buddy. We got you. Come on, Earl, man, you gotta, you gotta help us out a little bit. We ain't ever gonna get out of this house. Guys, you gotta get up and go. Are you freaking kidding me, man? I know you can walk. All you gotta do is get outside. There are cots outside. Come on. You can walk. Get up. We're gonna leave you here, buddy. We don't wanna do that, but 
We can't carry you all the way. Earl, get up. You called him, you need to go. Go to the hospital. The ambulance is outside waiting for you. Get up. All you gotta do is walk out that front door. Sure. Yeah, it's right outside, waiting for him. Earl, get up. You're right outside the door. Earl, get up. Yeah, we all he has to do is walk Come on, out there. Get up. Come on, you called, you wanted the help. Come on, get up. All right, we got another 10 feet. When they first got there, the officers showed him some kindness and compassion. Once EMS arrived, the supposed people with healthcare knowledge, the officers deferred to EMS and followed their lead, assuming they knew what they were doing. Don't fall face first on that cot. We're doing one swing though, we're not going to take any more breaks. Alright, we got you. Ready? Doing. They got your We're doing it. Right here. Cops right there. Right there. Keep going, buddy. Push. All you got to do is go right there. Watch your noggin. I know it's cold. I know it's cold. Yep, keep going, keep going. Oh, negative. Come on, buddy. Now get up on there, man. Come on, get up on there, old bud. They can't get you there if you don't get on the cot. Get up on there, Earl. It's a bed on wheels. Stand up. Stand up. All right, Earl, this is getting a little silly, man. They'll get him to the hospital. All right, thank you. According to the coroner's autopsy report, more died of compressional and positional asphyxia due to prone face down restraint on a paramedic transportation cot stretcher by tightened straps across back and lower body, or Zoltautit. Finley and Cadigan were arrested on January 9th and charged with first degree murder court documents show. They're being held at the Sangamon County Detention Facility on $1 million bond each. If you think these cops sucked, then wait till you see this next one who used a ridiculous excuse to gang up on a harmless civilian. Get the f*** out of my face. No, too. get the f*** out of my yeah. face. Yeah. Alright, cool. On October 31st, 2022, Officer Jakob Howell was called to a residence by a resident who complained about a neighbor. However, it was later discovered that most of the complaints were fabricated. Despite Despite this, the officer still proceeded to commit egregious acts against the neighbor. Yeah, yeah he sucks. He does. I've dealt with him. He's rude as shit. He is. Yeah. But this time, he jumped out of his car at me because I walked over just to be a, a nice neighbor this time. Yeah. And before I asked him, please turn your music down. He threw his lit cigarette at me, jumped out of the car. I had my German Shepherd with me, and you know, he started yelling at me and told me, you know, Abusive language. And Did the cigarette hit you? No, no. Did he threaten you in any way? Just his movements. But he is it is it true that they can play their music as loud as they want to until eleven o'clock? The ordinance is after eleven, but if he's disturbing the peace, then oh, he I'm is. gonna go have a talk with him. I've, I've talked to him before. He's always an he is an yeah. It's it's disturbing the peace. Yeah, I hear him. He's but I thought there was something that uh, if I could hear music 25 feet away, that was an ordinance that I read. Yeah, this that's is definitely one. more than. He's in his car, so I can hear him. And my window is my bedroom window. I can't. I can't go to sleep. Yeah, actually, yeah, we can throw that on him. Please do. Because I hear it. So oh, I'm gonna wait for my partner. Trust, trust me. He turns it up louder. I know. I'm gonna wait for my partner because he's always very aggressive. Yes, he is. So last time we almost got in a fight with him. So yeah. if he continues that, then he might be. I'm gonna try to find a reason. I would know. love that. Yeah. He also. Um, yeah. Oh, uh, please. I despise him. I uh, do you have your ID on you? 
Right off the bat, the officer made it clear that he did not like that man, and that this was not the first encounter he would have with him. And by the way he talked, it seemed that this time, he was ready to do something bad. Something really bad. I don't know what, he just acts real funny. Stay right there. Yo, Brian. Brian. Hold up. He said, uh, he hopped out of the car right here. Got her? Yeah. I'm trying to take it out. I hate it. Mm -hmm. Come out of He said, uh, he hopped out of the car right here. He hopped out at her? Yeah. I'm trying to take it out. I hate this guy. You know him? Yeah, I don't spot him last time. Okay, he never wants to ID him, so... Okay, now we have to. I've heard his music, so I can give him a sight. Okay. Citation. Well, let's do it. The corrupt cop ensured that he brainwashed his partner as well, so that when he did his evil deeds, he would have the support of the whole gang. No, too. get up from my yeah. face. Alright, cool. Get on your stomach. Get on your stomach. Wow. wow, I didn't say not to be. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Hey, Jill, Jill, Jill. Get on your stomach. Hey, man. I get on your stomach. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Get on your stomach. Get on your stomach. Oh, my God, guys. Get on your stomach. 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 Get on your no! Oh my god, no! Oh. What the fuck is he doing? No, I ain't breaking no law. Yes, you hey, 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 I ain't breaking no law. I ain't breaking no law. I ain't breaking no law. Hey, what you doing? Back up. No, back no, up. no, 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 no. Hey. No, 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 I need to. Is he here? Give him your hand. Sieta, we got the witness up here. That's my. Give me your hand. What's your page and number? Oh yeah. No shit. Yeah. Nope. I ain't guys. All right. I'll shoot you. I'll. He'll shoot me. All right. You're breaking the law. No, I'm not. You're a public servant. You want to get my face, man? You want to act like a big bad guy? You're a public servant. I'm not gentleman. breaking the law. I'm not breaking the law at all. I never break the law. The officer used the tape. Was his right to use it? His hatred toward that man came out in those moments, and he overstepped his bounds. But this was just the beginning, because things were about to get way worse for him. You guys trying to put me in jail for nothing, like second times. Hey, can we get you to 600? I'm trying to go back to school. Not a deployment. What the f is wrong with you guys? Hey, I'll see. Oh, what the f? What am I being arrested for? Being a cinema recording for? Being a cinema recording? Cinema is a piece of it, my camera. Recording? Recording? Is a piece of it. I am breaking the law. The state of Florida allows me to listen to my music. Till 11 p.m. Now we're about 125 feet in the city of Daytona. It's more after that. You can put that all you want, man. It's, it's more. You're going to jail tonight. It's 10 more. No, no. Uh, no stuff that we. Wherever, if I'm going to jail, you, you guys are. gonna get your job off. That's all right. Like for nothing. Yeah, up twice for nothing. Twice. Yeah, you can For nothing. Are no you trying to kick me up? Trying to hit me up? Trying to beat put my your face ID. off? Where's your ID? You trying to beat my face off? I got that. You want to get in my face, man? Mm -hmm. I told you last time you always tried to pick a fight why, with this man. Why I got it in the break? I ain't, ain't having that shit with nope. you. Oh my god, guys. What's your base? Sveta, записывай это. Record. What's your base number? We don't have bad numbers. No, oh, you, you, you don't have no base number. Yeah, I got these. Oh. Bad.
you you have to file the report, right? You oh, have yeah, to gonna... file the report, right? All yeah. the witnesses, all the fuck officers. That you'll, be, you'll, hey, you'll be a you'll be a I I uh, I didn't do anything wrong. Anything wrong at all? Back up. Hey, get, I, get, I get away. It's a glass. Get away. I don't give a get back. Back up. This is not law enforcement. Feelings don't trump rights. And feelings were the impetus for the violence conducted by these tyrants. Hey, stop pushing me! Hey, stop pushing my oh, man. Oh, 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 oh my god. What the f is wrong with you? I ain't yeah, got to I have to kick that leg out, hey, my man. Hey, hey. Hey, I'm being in this country for eight years, and I and I got clean ass. I ain't selling uh, no. no you've been arrested I ain't selling. Hey, nope, nope. <laughs> That's why you're getting. Man, what's your base number? Number? What's your base number? Yeah, you guys are hey, residents here, right? You're supposed to. You guys you are residents here, right? You have to push me like this, man. Stop. Take it me. Svet, снимай, пожалуйста. Hey, record this. Recorded. Those guys are getting fired because they're acting that way for nothing. I ain't breaking no law, man. What do you think I am? Nice. Oh, man, like, what you put me in car for? What's your name? What you put me in car for? What's your name? No, you don't have to put your feet on me like that, man. Oh. Yeah, you're just gonna get another charge, no. man. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy, guys. Uh. Mm. That's crazy, guys. I, I'm still uh, waiting for the court uh, where you guys pick me up. Remember that stuff? I'm still waiting for the court. What the fuck are picking me up for right now? I didn't break the law. I was listening to my music at the state of Florida law allows me to. What the what put the cops on me, bro? No point explaining it. Nope. Nope. Oh, and you still, you, you're pushing my feet on me, bro. <laughs> is one thing, but then humiliating them by putting your feet on them is another level of insane. Do you want to sit on your butt or you want to lay like that? Do you want to sit on your butt or lay like that? Hey, hey, please listen. Listen. Thank you. I ain't doing nothing wrong. If you got, if you guys got the power to put a gas on me, man, it's not, doesn't mean nothing. But I didn't break the Oh, I didn't break the Oh, what? Put the handcuffs on me, man. Because somebody don't like me, this guy who packed me up for nothing, like two months ago. Nope, I didn't. Nope, you can see the camera watch, man. Nope, you asked me for what? You hopped out of your car and you ran into Right, nope, nope. You doing the same? You're talking, man. You stopped me up. There being like six of you guys. And you asked me for ID, and right now you, you're trying to act smart. No, and you're trying you got to, like, my face, man. I told no. you to get back, and you wanted to keep walking toward me. Hey, That's I, why you're I on the didn't break no law right now. You can say whatever the f on. I'll shoot the f out of your ass. Oh, cool, you threatened me like five times I'm trying to get back to my CDL now. school. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not doing right. none of it. You can say whatever the f on, but, but the main huh? things, yeah. it's like, what time is it? Give me a come what on. time yeah, is yeah. it? What happened? 10, 10, so, 10, 50, 10, I get a call from that lady over there yeah. saying, this guy, I walked up to his music playing. Okay. Well, she's like, she wanted him to turn the music down, just started a noise complaint. I've been out with this guy before, he's always very aggressive. He hopped out at me and then doll last time. Okay. I already know who the guy was, or who the car was. Came over there, he gets out of the car, he's flipping her off, doing this. He said that he flipped a cigarette at the lady, and she, he hopped out at the lady. Okay. And so she felt threatened. When I get out with him, he gets out, he starts advancing towards me, I said, you get the... I One break kept advancing. And, you put and especially when you are a public servant, this is absolutely disgraceful from the officer and also from those who supported him. People like him deserve to be in jail, not out on the street exercising their oppressive power. It's safe to say that he has a huge lawsuit waiting to happen, which he will most probably lose. This cop was thoroughly corrupted, but the next cops were way worse, because what they did is beyond insane. July 31st, 2023, Minnesota State Patrol Trooper Ryan Londrigan conducted a traffic stop. The incident began when troopers pulled Cobb over for driving without functioning taillights, but things escalated soon after, leading to something that left the whole country in shock. Yeah, they, 
like I said, they want them hooked up and, and brought, brought down. So I'm just going to go a driver's side approach. And uh, yeah, he's nice to meet you. He's just amped. How you doing, my man? I'm gonna need you to step out, bro. We have some stuff to talk about, okay? We just have some stuff to talk about. So I'm gonna Every some... time y'all talk about, All right, we need some stuff to talk about, y'all been taking you to jail, but for what? Okay, we have, we have some stuff to talk about. This is Ramsey County, we just have to have you step out. Yeah, hold on, hold on, I know. Well, Ramsey County? Yes. Never. Okay, join on, just, just No, 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 because okay. I'll call my attorney right now. You have to step out, okay? Hold on, is it a warrant? No, it's not a warrant. Step out hold on, hold on, hold on. I'll explain it all out when you get out of the car. Hold on, because y'all finna get on some funny shit with me. Y'all keep it a buck with me, bro. But if y'all okay. finna get on some funny shit with me, y'all can tell me right now. Hand so me I can call me my, my attorney. Can you hand me the keys? Can, hand me my keys. Hand me the keys to the vehicle. Why? Hand me the key to the vehicle. Why? Just hand me the key. Why? Can y'all keep it a buck with me, bro? Y'all yep, pull me I'm, over my headlights. Okay. Yep. Yep. We already passed that. So like I said, you're gonna need to step out of the vehicle. Okay, we passed that, so where we at then? Okay. We're, you need to step out of the vehicle. So where are we at though? And I'm going to explain it all when we step out. When an officer begins asking for your car keys, you should know that you are probably dealing with a psychopath. And Cobb was about to find this out the hard way. Get out of the car now! Just holding that gun. Just holding that gun, man. Hey, stay with me, man. Stay with hey, me. Stay with me. I need this. I got Cobb tried to escape the tyrants as he saw what they were about to do to him if he got out of the car, but unfortunately, they did something way worse. Stay with me, man. Hey. <laughs> Stay with me. Hey, man. Straighten his legs out. Come on, Miko. Me, me too. Oh. Yep. Keep breathing, man. Keep, Keep breathing. breathing. Keep breathing. Stay with us. Two abdomen, three abdomen. We need uh, occlusive dressing. I need something. We have great really gunshot wounds. Yeah, yeah. Any copy? Give me a. Call it four for medics. Give me a, a scissors. 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 Uh, I don't see scissors. All right, give me some gauze to the back. Four shuttle three. That's one of five one four zero. Hold on. Clear. Yeah. Do you want bandage? <sighs> no, I need a... Uh... No, we're good. No, gonna... Do you got scissors? In my med bag. Right, nice. I don't have right here, cut it, cut it, cut it. Cut it. Good. Okay. I got one to the shoulder. Two. 
Okay, hold on. Let's roll right. What's in his back? There, cut his back. While ordering Cobb to get out of the car, the officer on the passenger side shot kill. Let's see the incident from the perspectives of other officers to really understand what actually happened. Say, step out of the vehicle. Yes, this is not a lawful. This, hey, man, you didn't see the crew. Yes, you can pursue. Take patrols with pads of LTAC 2 for pursuit of shots fired. Hey, stay with me, man. Stay with hey, me. stay with me. I need this. Yeah. All right, my way. My way. Stay with me, man. Hey. As you can see, both of the officers involved were actually hurt by Cobb as he dragged them along when he tried running away. Say, step out of the vehicle, you gonna explain to me, and he also... Get out of Finally, we have the footage from the squad car. Cobb was later pronounced at the scene. A trooper was later charged in February 20, 24, with unintentional murder as well as murder as a result of the shooting. Hennepin County Attorney Mary Moriarty later dropped the case in June 20, 24. After a review of evidence, do you think these troopers deserve to be behind bars? Let me know in the comments below. And if you like the video, subscribe so you don't miss out on the next one we have in store for you. Thanks for watching. This is Detective Mystery, signing off.